To be successful on Amazon today, you absolutely need a software. Without one, you're gonna be at a severe disadvantage against all the other sellers you're competing with. It doesn't matter what Amazon business model that you're doing, be it arbitrage, wholesale, private label, drop shipping, whatever. Now, over the years, Amazon's software market has kind of consolidated, leaving Jungle Scout and Helium 10 as the top two all-in-one tools that pretty much do everything. And I've used Jungle Scout for years, and I have experience with Helium 10 as well. But most people don't know about an up-and-coming third option as well, which is Seller Sprite. So in this video, I'm going to compare Seller Sprite, the two giants that are currently in the space. We're going to do a deep dive into everything and go over the advantages and the disadvantages that each software gives you so you can get the best results and the most sales and profit for the least amount of money spent on a software on your part. So first, let's tackle the elephant in the room, the pricing, right? So Jungle Scout has a few different plans. They have a basic plan at $49 a month, a sweet plan at $79 per month, and finally a professional plan at $199 a month or rounded up to 200, right? The starter plan for Helium 10 is $39 per month. They have a platinum plan after that for $99 a month and their diamond plan, their top plan is $279 per month. Now, Seller Sprite has a basic plan for $32 a month. They have a standard plan for $65 a month. They have an advanced plan for $107 a month and then a VIP plan for $100 $57 per month. Now, all three tools charge a fixed monthly fee, regardless of your revenue numbers, and each has the ability to pay upfront for the year to save some money if you want. Ultimately, they're all priced relatively similar, depending, of course, on the package that you select, but they all have several different options based on your specific needs, with Seller Sprite's basic plan coming in at the cheapest among all of them. Now, it is important to mention that Helium 10 does offer a free plan as well. It gives you, I think, 20 uses of their product research tool, 50 uses of their Chrome extension, and I believe one or two uses a day for their keyword research and the reverse ASIN tool lookup. And while it is helpful, it is pretty limited in what you can actually do with it. It's kind of just to test a little bit in the beginning and kind of get a taste of the software. Now, Seller Spray, on the other hand, offers a free trial to use their software with absolutely no restrictions. So you can take the power of the entire software for a test drive before you actually decide to subscribe or not. So full transparency from them, they are confident that if you try it, you'll stick with it long term. And I think that communicates a lot. So how accurate are all of these then the measuring sales for specific products, for specific opportunities and product categories as well? Well, I did research for like 45 minutes before I was gonna make this video on all of these to see if I could find some basics and some specifics on which one was better or worse. And I was gonna launch into the, well, this one provides an accurate, reliable revenue estimate because of X, Y, and Z. But realistically, if I'm being honest here, I've used each one of these and they all work pretty well. I haven't noticed any definitive difference in sales estimates or accuracy. And since I typically verify sales estimates across several different softwares, because of course I'm grandfathered into a bunch of different ones now because I've been selling for so long, there hasn't really been a time where there's been a sales estimate off by too much. Most estimates across softwares are pretty close and each does a pretty good job of it. Short answer here, they're all pretty equal in this department. Now, when it comes to keyword search accuracy, if for instance, since you're looking for launching a new profitable product and you're trying to gauge how many searches that main keyword gets versus the competition to find good niche opportunities and good products to launch. Often this is for private label products. All of these do a decent job at gauging keyword search volume too. Although if I'm splitting hairs here, I would say Helium 10 and Seller Sprite get the slight edge in this category. Although this is subjective and based off my own use over time as an Amazon seller for the past five or six years or so. But because Amazon does doesn't actually reveal actual keyword research volume. All of these search numbers that they're spitting out between all these softwares are best estimates and they should kind of be taken with a grain of salt. And while they're as accurate as they possibly can be, it's still always smart to use them to cut time doing broad research significantly in the beginning. But then after that, always check manually via the Amazon search bar to make sure and verify a bit before launching a product just based on their sales estimates. Now, here's all the features that each software offers offers on their website. So Jungle Scout has a product database and tracker, a keyword scout, sales analytics, a listing builder, an inventory manager, a supplier database, and review automation if you're trying to get more feedback and reviews on your products. Helium 10 has Blackbox, which is their product research tool. They have X-Ray, which is their product analysis tool. They have Cerebro, their keyword research tool. They have Magnet, their keyword research tool. They have Frankenstein, which is their keyword processor. They have listing optimization. They also have inventory management as well, which is 
gonna monitor all your inventory levels, forecast demand, and prevent you from going out of stock on your best products by warning you ahead of time. They also have Refund Genie too, which helps sellers recover lost revenue by identifying and filing claims for reimbursements from Amazon. Honestly, I love this feature, it's great. They also have email automation to get more reviews and feedback, a lot like Jungle Scouts. They have a market tracker, which monitors the market trends and competitor activities to help you stay competitive. And they have a ton of tools just ranging across the board that can help you with pretty much any Amazon business model. Now, Seller Sprite also has product research, they have keyword research, they have listing optimization, they have competitor analysis as well, sales estimation, review management, again, to help you get more reviews and feedback so you can stand out among your competitors, you know, get the buy box more and inspire customer trust to increase sales. They also have PPZ optimization as well if you wanna run ads, which really helps. So for an overall value score, Jungle Scout is ideal for beginners and intermediate sellers, in my opinion, that are looking for an all-in-one solution at a competitive price, right? It has comprehensive features, it's got accurate market data, and it's a valuable tool for growing an Amazon business when you're starting, that is a fact. Now, Helium 10 is a powerhouse with a ton of features. It has more of a catered feel towards more advanced sellers and larger businesses. Obviously, it's higher price is reflected in that, and it's justified by the depth of its tools and the accuracy of its data. And it's really a top choice, in my opinion, for Amazon sellers that are already making great money and looking for more features that go more in depth. And finally, Seller Sprite offers a balanced mix of essential tools that you need at an affordable price, right? While it might not have the level of advanced features of some of Helium 10's tools, it provides excellent value for small to medium sellers looking to optimize their Amazon business without breaking the bank. And Seller Sprite might be the best option if you're looking to get solid functionality without the hefty price tag of the other more well-known two. And as always, I tell new sellers in the beginning, when you don't have a lot of revenue and profitable products yet, the best move is not going out and getting all the expensive software programs that you see recommended on YouTube. When you're starting your business, especially on Amazon, and you're trying to scale, you do not need that. What you do need is to keep your costs as low as possible while trying to reinvest a large portion of your profit back into your business and inventory so that you can scale it. And this software by far is the best value for smaller sellers. But ultimately, when choosing between Jungle Scout, Helium 10, and Seller Sprite, consider your business needs, your budget, Budget, your level of expertise currently, and Jungle Scout offers a solid package at a reasonable price. Helium 10 provides unparalleled features for advanced users, and Seller Sprite delivers essential tools at an affordable rate. But Seller Sprite, in particular, in my opinion, stands out as the cost effective option that provides excellent value for small to medium sized sellers and beginners looking to start their Amazon business and scale it without breaking the bank. It also has all the essential features that you need to succeed on Amazon. Amazon, be it drop shipping, online arbitrage, private label, wholesale, whatever, at an affordable rate, but it also focuses on the ease of use in the software, which probably matters a lot to somebody watching this video and trying to start. So this makes an excellent choice for sellers who want powerful tools without paying for extra features that they might not need. And while you can't go wrong, honestly, with any of these Amazon softwares, I personally use Seller Sprite since you can get the most bang for your buck and it can be used for more business models overall. I I use Seller Sprite to this day. I've done several tutorials on it now. If you want to try it completely free, you can do so through the first link in the description. But as always, guys, this is just what works for me, so I hope it helps.